girl miss cinnamon spice i haven't been on here in a couple weeks and posted a video but i am back bitches <laughs> but uh yes yeah, so today's um video is going to be about a wig review you guys already know let me get into showing you guys what this wig looks like but before we get into that i need you guys to go ahead and subscribe because this is almost at 4k thank you thank you you guys are awesome i'm almost at 4k so guys make sure you subscribe because we're trying to reach that goal of like 4k by new year so we are almost there you guys we got a couple more weeks into the new year so let's bring it in strong and get this channel to 4k but yeah thank you guys okay so this wig is from amazon you guys um and like I said, it is an 8-inch um, Bob style Brazilian wet and wavy wig. I'll show you guys how it looks once I um, take it out the box. So you get some bracelets here in the box, um, which are cute. Some like neon colored bracelets. And then also in the box you get two wig caps. So that comes in handy. Then the wig comes in this mesh bag. So we're going to go ahead and take the wig out of the bag here. And it comes in another bag. <laughs> and this is the wig. I'm gonna take the net off. I'm gonna move closer so you guys can actually see it. Where the heck is the beginning of the net? Okay, here we go. Excuse my nails, I know they look crazy. I have to go to the nail shop. Um, but yes, this is how the wig looks. Let's get rid of that tissue paper. So this is how the wig looks. It is eight inches and it is, like I said, a bob style wig. Um, this wig is 150 density, um, short, deep, curly bob Brazilian lace wig. So this is Brazilian. It comes with a pre-plugged hairline already. And as you guys can see, it does come with baby hairs already out. So that's really good. So this is a ear to ear lace as well. And it does come with the lace in the back, which I never use <laughs> ever because it never stays down to my head. I told you guys that I can never get this to stay glued down. Um, it also comes with the adjustable straps here. It has one, two, three, four combs here, you guys. So that's always good. So that is the construction of the wig. I can say, I don't know if this is like jet black or if this is just like that natural brown color. But yeah, this is how the wig looks. This is the curl pattern of the wig already. I haven't washed or conditioned it or anything like that. I literally just took it out the pack. So that is how she is looking right now. Hey guys, so yeah, what I'm gonna do is, now that we have our wig out the pack, and like I said, it is very short, it is eight inches, and I'm gonna try it and see like what kind of simple little style I can come up with and see um, how it looks on me. I mean, we'll try it out and see how everything looks, I guess. But yeah, the hair is very, very soft. It is very, the curls you can see are very, very tight, which I do like that. So I can't wait to see how this looks once it gets like wet and wavy and you know, all that fun stuff. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put this wig on and come back on here and show you guys how this wig looks on me and what I think about this wig. Hey guys, so I am back and this is just a style that I decided to go with. Um, I will tell you that I didn't add any product to this wig. I literally just wet this wig and the curls just pretty much were flawless. They just pretty much um, ended up looking like this, which is like this really pretty wet and wavy look. Um, the hair is very, very soft. I didn't get absolutely no shedding with this wig at all so far and I really didn't comb it that much but I did like run my fingers through it and like no shedding came out of the wig um, at all. I told you guys the hair is very, very, very soft. It's very bouncy and it's actually like really full. Like this is really full. I actually like the kind of shortness. At first I was like, mm, I don't know how that's gonna look but I actually like how it looks short and like this little bob style especially with like a side part or middle part you can do whatever you want I decided to do like a slight side part I will say though with the parting you do not have that much room to part at all um, my parting space probably was like about that much like so my parting space probably was like that much space that I can part I don't know if you guys can see like that's as like 
they're like right here as far as back as my parting can go that's as far back as my parting can go so i really didn't have a lot of parting space and i do like my wigs you know the parting to go at least to the middle of your head to look a little bit more natural but i am okay with that there are tricks that you can do to open that up and kind of pluck it and put some concealer on that part um except it's like a lot of tracks right here so it might look a little funny and not natural at all i just left it how it is right now i will say that i did enjoy the fact that this wig came with baby hairs i did not have to do anything to the baby hairs and i also like the fact that the hairline was already pre-plucked because sis, i did not feel like plucking this wig <laughs> i mean it's up to you if you pluck your wigs or not but i just didn't feel like plucking my wig so i do like the fact that the wig had already came pre-plucked and with the baby hairs there wasn't really anything I had to do to this wig except put it on um, the only thing I will say like with this unit you will have to bleach the knots I didn't bleach the knots for the sake of this video and honestly when I put it on it doesn't look that bad especially for the fact that the parting space isn't that much so technically you really don't have to bleach the knots because you really can't you can't really tell um, since you're not parting it that much, but I'll go ahead and show you guys a close-up of my baby hairs So that is how my baby hairs look right now And I really didn't do anything too fancy so I just went ahead and used my uh, mousse uh, What kind of mousse did I use? Lotta body. I bought the Lottie body Lotta body mousse <laughs> and it works super good way better than my Tresemme mousse like that mousse is so bomb um, I really like the Lottie Body Mousse. I thought I was gonna have to put some gel in my hair, but I did not put any gel in my hair. I literally got my spray bottle and sprayed my hair to my lightness. If you wanna like wet it completely and have it just like soaking wet and have that style, that's totally fine. But if you just want kind of like a cute, curly, kind of big, poofy kind of look, you can go ahead and do that. I'm pretty sure you can tease this hair out and make it actually bigger and fuller if you wanted to, but I just didn't want to do that right now. Like I said, I do like this kind of like bob, uh, deep wave kind of style, so I'm going to be just rocking this for a little bit, but I'm pretty sure there are other styles that you can do with this hair. Uh, so yes, that is everything that I like and did not like about the wig. I really didn't have any dislikes. I just didn't like the fact that the party wasn't like super... Um, it didn't go back super far but once again like it's not that big of a deal because this unit is really cute really soft i mean no tangling or anything like that it's a really really nice unit i do really like it so what i'm gonna do is do a 360 so you guys can see the entire unit that is how the hair looks doing a 360 view there's really not anything else i can say about this hair i told you everything i like about the hair the softness i love the curl pattern i love that i just have to put water in it it has like a natural shine to it i didn't have to add any product or anything to it um the hair is entangling or anything like that there was no shedding there's no smell i know that's a big deal for you guys when you get these wigs this wig did not have any smell at all like i don't smell anything with this wig um the parting was just not my favorite. Uh, the baby hairs and the pre-pluck, that was lit because some wigs don't come like that and you gotta do all of that work. So with this, I just had to like literally put my lace on, do my baby hairs, cut the, you know, the rest of the lace off and I called it a day. It's up to you if you want to uh, bleach the knots or not because the knots are not bleached. But other than that, yeah, there's really nothing else I can say about this wig <laughs> and I feel like I'm repeating myself. So I am going to go ahead and end this video right now, you guys. Thank you for watching. Um, sorry I didn't show you guys how I put this wig on, but I do have a tutorial already of how I lay my lace. I did try a different method, though, that I think I'm going to film for you guys um, of how I put my lace on. And it actually turned out to look 10 times better than how I was doing it before. So, yeah, I'm going to be filming that very soon. But if you guys want to check out my video of how to put your um, lace front on or how to uh, slay your lace, make sure you guys go ahead and do that. Make sure you guys check out all my other videos. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like. Make sure you share this video, you guys. I hope you like this very short video of this wig. This was just like a little wig review, no tutorial or anything like that. I hope you guys did enjoy it. I hope you guys go out and purchase this wig if you really like it. I will leave everything down below about where you can get this wig from and all the details about this wig and everything like that. Um, other than that, guys, I guess I will see you on my next video. Bye.